Well, Natty, your commitment 2022 coverage. Voters in District 21 need to make their choice next week. The district spans from Northern Palm Beach County through Martin and St. Lucie counties. I sat down with the candidates on the ballot. Democrat Karina Valderamos Robinson challenging Republican U.S. Representative Brian Mast for his seat. I spent 25 years serving in the military, several more in Washington, D.C. at the Pentagon, and serving on Capitol Hill. Congressman Mass, a three-term incumbent. It is an honor to serve. I always tell people, this is not my seat. This is the seat of we the people. I'm allowed to sit in it for a window of time and for as long as you allow me to, to sit in it. With the midterm elections less than a week away, some wonder how the Supreme Court's decision on abortion will influence voters. It is a woman's right to choose in every regard. It's not a federal issue, it's not a state issue. This is our choice to do what's best for our reproductive health care. It's an issue that I think rightly so, the Supreme Court has given down to the states. They said this is not going to be a federal issue. Congress, the Senate, the House of Representatives, they're not gonna deal with this. State legislators and governors are going to deal with this. Now for me personally, I'm a pro-life guy. I have four children. School safety, a top priority for both. But when it comes to teaching gender identity and sexuality in school. Absurd, not something I want to, to take place whatsoever. I don't think it has any place in our schools. Valderamos Robinson teaches and directs criminal justice and homeland security programs. Generally with what I teach, we don't talk about gender identity. But what I do talk about is the 60 plus hate groups that we have active in Florida and how they, whether they don't accept people of the LGBTQ community or a certain ethnicity, it's wrong. We're all God's children. Both candidates hoping to claim victory.